ไฮโน I do uh, DIY DIY uh, DIY Do it yourself Yes DIY Hello For those ones who have been follow my videos would know that I'm a violin maker violinist okay artist I have nothing to do with cars I know nothing about cars until recently uh, I took my car to a garage mechanic and he said oh you're quite wrong this is wrong that's wrong and it cost me six hundred dollars to fix it then I almost said yes then I just okay have my second source I want to take the car for the second painting then I talk to another garage and found nothing is wrong nothing wrong at all the second place the second mechanic only changed oil for me for sixty dollars okay now I have three cars this one and this one and my old truck okay so I decided to learn a little bit uh, basic ideas basic knowledge about the maintenance of the cars so last time I made a video I cleaned up the air filter but today I will show you how to add coolant okay I purely learned all this by YouTube videos I have not been to any other places I only follow YouTube videos and check the coolant and for this car and for this car they are computerized the computer will tell you what is wrong even they have a flat tire they will tell you but for my old truck but for my old pickup truck I think that is another story uh, it has a computer but I don't think uh, it will tell you the coolant is low so I checked uh, the coolant on this truck it is low I watched a YouTube video actually a couple of videos it tells me on 2003 Frontier the coolant box is here this is the one and what I do is you open it and then you check okay uh, I don't know if I can film uh, it is actually here low and high low and high difficult to see okay so you must see the coolant is between that but from here it's almost impossible to see what I did is that I use this okay I use this to touch it until it touches okay so almost like this high then I go down to measure it is obviously low it is obviously too low okay so what I did is I took a picture of this place okay and a picture of this then I bring this to Walmart and ask people say I want to buy this I point this I want to buy this fluid so Walmart sold me this so the gentleman who works at Walmart introduced me this one this is already ready made do not add water it is 50 50 already you just add it in okay now I add it in and you see even an amateur know nothing about the cars can do this okay so you can do but do check the videos make sure it's the correct place and make sure everything is right and take pictures ask people if you like me know nothing about cars okay now here we go and only do this when the car is cold okay you cannot do this when the engine is hot okay when the car is cold you see this and do this work here we go
always check it always check it now we'll test it again okay this is the height this is the height i measure from here down I, th I think now it is correct okay it is uh, if you have lowest here highest here now the fruit is at this place I think it's correct okay <laughs> now I successfully add some coolant by myself a pure amateur please check your coolant if it's too low you should learn from me take pictures especially take a picture of this and go to Walmart or any car places ask people and tell people what kind of car you have and what color the current is because current also have a red color red color is not for this car red color is different okay so you must make sure you buy the current is the same kind as your car then you add in simple okay I made a mistake. I say, he said it's a red. I said yes, my car is red. He said no, we don't sell red. You have to go to auto, uh, some 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 company. Okay. I said no no no. I said my car is red, but inside this is not red. Then he sold me this. Okay. Now you just screw it back. Okay. Close it. Make sure it's closed. okay you can also check this make sure the engine is cold okay say it again engine is cold you open this one okay if the water is not enough you can add more just the ordinary water and uh, if this place is dirty you should clean it up okay that i did yesterday i did not do a video about this but yesterday i cleaned this up and add water in now finish hello i do uh do i y diy a diy do it yourself yes diy i finished successfully finished to add coolant in okay what i did is that i take a picture of the whole place mm -hmm. and the picture particularly here mm. then i went to walmart asked the gentleman i want to buy this then he asked me a question, it is red? I said, yes, my car is red. But he said, no, 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 we don't sell red. You have to go to AutoZone. I said, anything to do with the car color? I said, no, 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 the current is red or not? I said, no, the current is not red. It's kind of yellow, uh, green, or, or, or blue, something. I said, oh, that's ordinary. That's the basic one. So then he introduced me this one. Mm -hmm. It cost me like eight dollars. Eight dollars is ready made, 50 50. Do not add water. Oh. So you can just use like this. Cool. So this is the ordinary one. But if you found inside is red color, don't have to mention the color of your car. Okay. Okay, don't <laughs> say my car is red and my car is blue. If you say, oh, my car is black, we don't sell black coolant you know yeah okay so don't make mistake then i just tested it what i did is i use this uh -huh. put it in when i touch then i measure the don't height throw that out that's cami straw yeah but uh, <laughs> but i touched it okay you cannot drink Wash it anymore it. You and to clean it and, and also I, I dropped one inside here oh, I, no. I, I can't take it out you have to because they're plastic they'll melt you have oh. to get it out somehow I don't know, we have to though. I have to go over and let people in. Okay, okay? let's go, let's go. Okay. Okay, congratulate me. Congratulate me. Congratulations. Yes. I'm so good. Yes. You are proud of me. You, you are proud of me. Yes, I'm proud of you. Thank you. Very good. Bye bye. See you in a little bit. And the next time I will learn to change or to add power steering fluid okay this is here and another thing is here i think this is a transmission fluid what is this 
Okay, this is break fruit. Break fruit. Next time I also learn how to add break fruit. Okay, and I don't know where is the transmission fruit. Maybe it is here. This is the engine. Maybe I don't know. Yeah, this is the engine wheel. Okay, mission completed.